Hello dear ones, it's Alice. I'm of the stars. This is a community alert and I'm asking uh, for action. I'm asking for solutions here. Um, the, the situation right now is that a lot of light is coming in to earth. New light is coming into new earth. And uh, it will be likely to continue coming in through September. Okay. What this light is doing in many cases is it's causing to people to become very, very drowsy in the afternoons and to need to, to rest and to sleep and to nap. And especially for the commute crowd, after they uh, uh, leave work around 4 or 5 in the afternoon, uh, they're, they're being hit with a sudden wave of unexplained uh, drowsiness vast drowsiness where they need to pull over. Pull over off the freeway. First, get off the freeway. And second, find just find a street and rest. Okay? Rest and sleep for as long as you need to. Um, for those that haven't left work yet or who in the mid-afternoon, such as I today, have just finished hiking or, or doing shopping or whatever, you need to just wait where you are and, uh, and, and take a nap in your car for as long as necessary. Make sure you have plenty of ventilation and so forth in your car. And then take your trip home. And the reason for this is that unless we do this, we'll see an in increased incidence of traffic difficulties and, and accidents and so forth. Okay, So at this time, this year, 2016, it's very important for each person to realize that they're being hit with these waves of drowsiness, especially in the afternoons and evenings, and to take action to make sure that they get the rest that they need um, and then continue on with driving a vehicle. Okay, for the, for the um, law enforcement, I ask that they understand that this is a new event that is happening on Earth and take measures to make sure that people are safe when they need to not be driving home in the afternoon but instead need a safe place to rest. Okay, I understand in many parts of the cities that it's not possible to do this right now. Some allowance is going to have to be made by people in neighborhoods or people in shopping centers to allow people to get the rest that they need so that they can be safely dri driving home. The difficulty that seems to be coming up for the last month or so is that this, this increase in the light is causing feelings of anxiety and lack of safety in many people uh, today, in the world today, who are probably working a little too hard and, uh, and not paying as much attention to stress relief and so forth as, they, as would be best right now. And so the people in the houses, if a person goes to park outside of their house, they're a little bit anxious and upset and afraid and they will call the police to come and get the person to move on, okay? And uh, the people, if you park in a, a, a lot, say, at a park, you know, the, or like that, then uh, the, the light is causing people to react against waking up by, by acting out. And so there's a po an increased possibility of acting out in public parking lots right now, uh, especially recreational parking lots that are a little secluded, which would otherwise be ideal places for, um, for recuperating and getting ready for the drive home. And then as far as law enforcement is concerned, just like everybody else, they're subjected to the light and they need to to, to de-stress and take time whenever whenever uh, it's it feels like they should and so they themselves need to pace themselves their departments and allow people there to take their naps you know to take their little t bit of time out from from their very difficult duties 
whenever is necessary so that, so that they can deal with increased uh, anxiety on the part of the general population. Um, for those that feel that this is a, uh, an inconvenience to their schedules, okay, um, know that in the early morning hours, uh, around 2 or 3 a.m. during the weekdays, uh, if you get to bed really, really early, even though it's not in your schedule and you never did it before and you can't figure it out and it's, it sort of hits you like a ton of bricks and suddenly you have to rest. I'm hearing it from all sides now. You know, This is happening here on Earth. It's a consequence of the beautiful new light coming in. But if you do go to bed early, even though you don't want to, you can get up uh, like very early and find a immensely pleasant... Um, revitalized energy at that hour of the morning and a chance to to recuperate like mental balance and emotional balance and physical balance takes place at the hours of the night between about unfortunately five o'clock in the in the evening until about three in the morning so um so just uh, it is kind of fun getting up early you know so that's the consolation prize All right, now the, 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 the light of the sun is very quiet, as can be seen by surfing to spaceweather.com. But should there be a solar event, such as a CIR or a folding of the uh, solar winds or um, very intense uh, proton fall or... Um, some M-class solar flares or X-class solar flares that are Earth-directed, then I feel that this symptom of the Great Awakening that we're all experiencing as humankind right now would most likely become more intense. Safety and love and light and joy to everyone.